Well, John, we've been driving around the Liverpool Galeville area for probably about the, the last half hour or so. And right now we're in Galeville on the corner of Greenpoint and Ferncliff Road near Buckley Road. We've got this tree behind us here. A lot of the streets and the side streets look just like this. That tree fell onto a power line earlier and caught fire. And the fire department is on its way out now. National Grid just killed the power there. As you can see that the power line is down. And as you can see in the top of the utility pole there, there is a bolt that has been twisted sideways. It's diagonal. Normally, firefighters say that is straight up. That just shows how powerful it was to take it down and strain those power lines here. Now, we did have neighbors tell me that we did have some hail, some rain, and some wind in this area, in the Galeville area. And just to show you how powerful the wind was, you can see on that fence right there, we've got some leaves pushed up against the fence. And all the houses pretty much look like that here, too. On the streets here, we've got lots of leaves here if you can see from the wind and this puddle here now this is just the remnants of what was the flooding earlier but a lot of the side streets here in galeville and in liverpool are filled with water and firefighters tell me we did speak with the deputy chief earlier today they tell me if you see any still water please please pull over turn around call 911 do not go near it because there could be live wires there and you could be risking your life. Now, we do know that firefighters are working around. They're assessing the damage. They're responding to all of this damage here in the Liverpool Galeville area, and they are assessing the damage, and they will help you out. We will, of course, continue to follow this for you and head to our website at localsyr.com. Of course, our meteorologists will keep you updated on these warnings as well. But right now, if you can, stay inside. It's sunny and bright right now, so we're not seeing any of the storm anymore. But, of course, there is damage and down wires, so please be careful. Back to you. Some important information there, Julia. Thank you. And of course, many are now without power from this weather, as you saw all of those trees down in areas like Liverpool. As of 5.30 this evening, the power outage map on National Grid's website showing nearly 2,000 customers are affected by power outages. Their time frame is estimated that about 9 p.m. tonight, that should all be taken care of. But you can stay updated with that on localsyr.com. Plenty of you have been